Firstly, choose the correct answer. To answer this type of questions, don't forget to read all the choices you have. Number one, in a quarter million pound equals how many pounds? From unit one, we know that in half million pound equals five hundred thousand pounds. So, the quarter million pounds is equal to two hundred fifty thousand pounds. Question number two. The value of the digit seven in the number twenty-seven thousand three hundred fifty-one. Why is not the value? هم بوسط عندنا كده على digit seven. هلا إن digit seven is in the thousand place. Well, seven in the thousand place has the value of seven thousand. Has the value of seven thousand. في عندي طريقة تانية ممكن إن أكتب digit seven هنا وأحط جنبها أكمل ال digits اللي جنبها كلهم zero فلاقي هنا جنبها three digits فنكملهم zeros فلاقي برضو ال value طلعت عندنا seven thousand. Question number three: The million is the smallest number that formed from how many digits? أول ما نسمع كلمة million في أولاد هيقولون يا مس nine digits طبعا it's أقول stop it's not a right answer هي فعلا معها nine بس مش nine digits هي nine zeros وفي معانا one في الأول one وبعدين nine zeros هي one digit one ومع nine zeros okay فهنلاقي كلهم مع بعض هيدوني how many digits كلهم مع بعض هيطلعوا ten digit numbers برضو ممكن أولادي يجوا يقولوا لي في المليون إن المليون six digits لا هي المليون six six zeros ومعانا ال one فيبقوا كلهم مع بعض seven digits question number four five hundred five meter squared or half meter squared علشان أعمل comparison هنا لازم إن أنا أحاول الكيلومتر اللي عندنا ل لmeter squared ال half kilometer squared equals fifty thousand meter squared fifty thousand meter squared طبعا هنا في عندي على ال left part five hundred five meter squared وعلى ال right part fifty thousand meter squared ف automatic the right answer is smaller than question number five The highest common factor for the two numbers two and four. طالب مني the highest common factor for the digits two and four. نروح على الدرافت بتاعتنا ونعمل factorizing. هلا إن two is equal two. طيب number four بنعملها factorizing. هلا إيها equals two times هنعمل سيركل على ال common factors اللي عندي the highest common factor is equal to two so the right answer here is two question number six the least common multiple for the two numbers three and six is هنروح على الدرافت برضو هنعمل factorizing number three Equals number three equals three. Okay, three. Number six equals three times two. 
في ال least common multiple احنا بناخد ال common multiples وال not common equals فهلاقي هنا ان ال common factor عندي 3 هناخد واحدة من ال 3 times ال 2 هيطلع عندي result 6 so the least common multiple for the two number 3 and 6 is equal to 6 question number 7 The number space is divisible by 2, 3, and 5. عايزين نشوف مين من ال choices اللي عندنا is multiple by 2, 3, and 5. هنرجع كده ال divisibility هنلاقي إن any even number is divisible by 2. وإذا كان عندي sum of the digits divisible by 3 يبقى كل number divisible by 3. وال divisibility of number 5 If the unit's digits is zero or five, if أنا كده أقدر أقول إن number the divisible by five. طيب نبص على ال digit six. Six is an even number, so it's divisible by two. Six موجود عندنا في table three, so it's divisible by three. Six ما عندناش هنا six is not zero or five. يبقى هنا not divisible by five. يبقى هنا six is not the right answer. Number ten. 10 is an even number, so it's divisible by 2. 10 has the unit's digit 0, so it's divisible by 5. 0 plus 1 equals 1, will 1 not divisible by 3? يبقى برضو 10 is not a right answer. Let's look at number 15. 15 is not an even number, so it isn't divisible by 2. يبقى هي خلاص برضو not a right answer number 30 30 is an even number divisible by 2 the sum of its digits is 3 with 3 divisible by 3 when units digits عندنا is 5 with 5 divisible is 0 sorry with 0 divisible by 5 so 30 is the right answer 30 is the right answer Question number eight: Three millions, three thousands, and three. I need to know from the choices we have. Name the number that has three in the millions place, or three in the thousand place, or three in the units place. طبعا كلنا أكيد بنعرف نحل الكويشن ده. هلا إن third choice هو the right answer. The number that I have: three millions, three thousand, and three. Number nine, the smallest prime number is. طبعاً الزيرو is not an a prime number. Number one is not a prime number. Number two is a prime number. And number three is a prime number. So here, who is the smallest? Two or three? أكيد number two هو the smallest. ومش بس the smallest هو the smallest even prime number. Question number ten. One million and hundred thousand. One in a number. One million and hundred. تعالوا نكتب ال number in digits. One million and a hundred thousand. وهنا ال one million and hundred طبعا. The sign must be greater than. Must be greater than. In hundred, and then here in the units place, but in hundred, and then here in the thousand place. So one million and one hundred thousand is greater than one million and one hundred. Number eleven. The sum of measures. Of the interior angles of a triangle equals how many degrees? Any triangle, any triangle has three angles. The sum of their measures are one hundred and eighty degree. One hundred and eighty degree. يبقى ال 3 angles لازم الصم بتاعهم يطلع في الآخر 180 degree 
السؤال ده من أسئلة بتاعت الامتحانات المهمة question number 12 the two diagonals are equal in length in each of the square and the rhombus or the square and the rectangle or the rectangle and the parallelogram طبعا from the properties of the quadrilaterals we know that the two diagonals are equal in the square and in the rectangle so the right answer here is the square and the rectangle طيب لو كان هو بيسألني بيقول لي the two diagonals are perpendicular فكنا هنجاوب عليه ونختار ايه the square and the rhombus نروح على question number 13 the perimeter of the square of side length 4 cm the perimeter of a rectangle whose dimensions وكلمة dimensions هنا أول ما نشوفها على طول نعرف إن هو بيكلمني على length وال width نعرف إن هو بيكلمني على length and width are 5 cm and 3 cm عايزين نحط sign smaller than or greater than or equals smaller than or greater than or equal نروح على الدرافت بتاعتنا ونشوف يا ترى ايه هي right answer parameter of the square طبعا طلابي الاعزاء عارفين ان parameter of the square equals side length times 4 بنقول عليها length L or S times 4 يديني هنا السايد لينث 4 سم اقول له 4 تايمز 4 ايكوالز 16 سم طيب نشوف البريمتر اوف ذا ريكتانجل بريمتر اوف ذا ريكتانجل Perimeter of any rectangle equals length plus width between brackets all times two. إحنا طبعا عرفنا إن the dimensions اللي هو كتبها لي تحت هما the length and the width. بنشيلها ونحط مكانها the length and the width. نبدأ نحط جوا the brackets three. أو 5 plus 3 times 2 هنلاقي عندنا إن 5 plus 3 equals 8 times 2 equals 16 centimeter لو جينا لاحظنا هنا هنلاقي ال perimeter of the square 16 centimeter perimeter of the rectangle equals 16 centimeter so the right answer here is equals is equal كده ما هنقدر نختار sign equal question number 14 99 plus 1 إيه اللي هيحصل لما نحط 1 plus 99999 هنلاقي إن الريزلت اللي هتطلع عندي هتكون 100,000